There's 10 seconds on the five on three. Drop pass. Side to side. Back out. Delgaizo with it. That's Mark Delgaizo. Diagonal pass down low off the skates of Lopina. That's in and saved. And then a follow up and a goal. Cal Keefuf gives UMass its first tally of the season. And it's 1 0 on the power play goal. As they just continued to pound down low. Really started with Bobby Trevino about 45 seconds ago where he could have tried to stuff it on Vomachka, but instead he kept it outside, which was a real smart play. And that was actually earlier in the five on three. Keefuke right down low, waiting by the crease there. Just taps it home as Vomachka, as you called, Adam. He went post to post a couple of times from the USHL, and he goes, I know that's the premier junior league, but you guys have to learn how to play in Hockey East. It's a whole different league. And in front, shot, score. Kale Howarth on a blind back pass by Johnny Evans, and UConn has tied it up here in the first. Looks like UConn's doing well, and Mike Cavanaugh directing his team with misdirections. Again, we saw the counterclockwise stuff that never happened. They came to go back after Murray, and Matt Murray looked like he was expecting something else out of the UConn offense here. Let's see if we can pick it up. Well, watch as the puck goes behind the net. Evans dekes the play, and then it comes back the other way. Murray yeah. assumed he was coming around one. Bangs its way out to center ice. A flailing with at it by Regali is that's Bollinger that works it away. Karashik loses an edge, and so UMass gains the inside beat on the puck. Chow works it free. As Bollinger now back down to Chow. Slams on the brakes right at the end line. Out in oh, front. Shot you. score. Incredible pass by Chow. And then it's Garrett Waite with a bang home finish. UMass back on top. Waite with his first UMass hockey goal. Not his first NCAA goal again. The transfer from Minnesota takes a tremendous feed, as Adam said. But the idea is you got to get yourself in position. And Waite read the play. Watch him here. Quick little pass. Chow. Wait, reads it. Comes right into the slot. Fires a pass for Majka. Affairs that we've seen between these two programs the last couple of years. And again, basically being the first game of the season, which it is, and with no exhibition games, no, which are mostly, not all of them, but most of them for uh, hockey East teams and Northeast teams are played against Canadian colleges. Just those did not happen this year. Cross ice pass. Wrist shot. Tape to tape, wrist shot score. That's McDonald who finished through Tomaj Vomajka. The next goal belonged to the Minutemen. And they've got themselves a two goal lead more than halfway through this third period. Knocked about 15 and 25, doing very well for the Minutemen as far as first impressions. And the freshman from Gross Point, Michigan, Alden McDonald, beats Vomajka for his first NCAA goal. You can see the Minutemen going point to point here. And that's a short side goal there. McDonald, I didn't see it, Adam, to be truthful with you, and I know the UMass bench was very vociferous on the UMass penalty in the call on Colin Felix. Nice job of playing a puck on the ice. Here's Trevino, wrist shot, knocked down, follow-up, score! That's Jones with the finish, and a great job of forcing a turnover. And UConn's defensive end of the ice to create a 2-1 opportunity and now has created a 4-1 lead. Super pressure right there, Trevino and Jones working it there. And Trevino, we said, very crafty with the puck, fed it over to Jones. And that's given the Minutemen a real good lead here. You can see the shot by Trevino. Knocked right four down. Four expires, it'll be eight seconds of a power play for the Minutemen with Gatcomb still in the box. Here's a wrist shot and a score. And that goes in as a power play goal for UMass. And so all of a sudden late, this one's comfortable for UMass. They're a 5-1. The guy we talked about, the Greg Carbill's looking to come off an injury and really have a good senior year is Oliver Chow. He gets the goal, already had an assist on the night. So a good night for Oliver Chow. You take a look here, just as the 4-4 uh, four four was expiring, Chow was manning the point, got into the slot, fired a pass for Bochka, who...